we will start with Andrew Barry releasing a statement on the releasing of Senator J.C. Treder, NFLPA uh, president. Uh, for the past five years, J.C. has been a mainstay and Iron Man at Center for us, came to our organization at a time of instability, was one of the key veterans that helped us turn the tide over the past several years. Leadership both within the locker room, on the field, will be missed. We wish J.C. Treder well as he continues his career. Uh, let's take a look at one of the reasons that they, in fact, made that move. It is, uh, has to do with cap savings. Uh, so they cut J.C. Treader, they release them, they save $8.25 million plus some change. Uh, they also traded uh, Mac Wilson for Chase Winovich. We'll get into that a little bit later, but again, a cap savings. So the Browns currently are um, 20.9, so almost $21 million under the cap, according to uh, Jack Duffin. With that, let's welcome in Scott Petrak, Browns beat reporter for the Illyria Chronicle Telegram. You can also read him on brownzone.com. Um, Scott, J.C. Treader, clearly a, uh, a salary move, and the Browns do need the flexibility because they're going to go get an edge rusher or a wide receiver or try to add and build out this roster. Yeah, for sure. If it all came down to production, and availability, J.C. Treader would still be on the roster. He was really good for his five years here. You know, and Drew Barry mentioned the instability before Treader arrived. Instability was the first word that came to my mind. He really stabilized the offensive line, first of all, and then, you know, helped in the locker room, helped with the franchise turnaround overall. Um, smart guy, made a bunch of the line calls, you know, would help the younger linemen. It's a good guy to have around, but if you can save $8 million in cap space and you're – you know, going to pay Amari Cooper $20 million shows up on your books tomorrow and you might make a trade and you might sign an edge rusher. Um, you need all those, all that money. And there's a reason that they drafted Nick Harris in the fifth round a couple of years ago. And Nick Harris did play well in the, the game that he started for Treader um, against the Packers. So that um, is certainly worth noting.